Oh my god. That's it. We're not gonna play no more. No, I want the free song. This is my first time at the OC Fair, and I love it because I love to eat everything, especially desserts. I would like to see some animals. I'm is not it? looking forward to these things. I don't know if they're trying to snowboard or whatever, but it seems like a ski lift that's going nowhere. I don't want to go on any stupid rides and risk my life when I could be eating nice food. The OC Fair, short for Orange County Fair, was first held in the summer of 1890. The fair started out with just a horse race and livestock exhibits. By the 1900s, carnival-like attractions were added on and became a yearly occurrence. They consist of amusement rides, crazy food vendors, innovative merchandise vendors, games of luck and skill, thrill acts, and amino acts. Shortly after, in 1925, a rodeo and carnival were added. In 1949, the OC Fair became a five-day event, and when the city of Costa Mesa became part of Orange County in 1953, it started hosting the fair, making it a 23-day summer event! The fair has attracted more than a million people every year, with each year surpassing the previous. Baby. Today, I'm looking forward to riding a whole bunch of fair rides, eating a whole bunch of like <laughs> really? deep fried random ass food. For example, there's um, deep fried Reese's peanut butter cup that I want to try, deep fried Twinkie, deep fried Oreo, anything deep fried they make it here and I want to try it because it's just a bunch of odd shit that you can't get anywhere else. Deep fried dookie? I wouldn't eat that. That's, that's pretty much stinky tofu, dude. That's true. In terms of rides that I want to get on, I want to experience all of them here. Like, if they go really fast, I want to try it. The only thing that I'm scared about is, like, the sketchiness about them, just because they have to, like, build it and then break it down and then travel yep. somewhere else, build yep. it, break it down, travel somewhere else. Yep. So I'm just a little bit scared. But that's what yep. makes yep. it more yep. exhilarating yep. is the fact that I could die at any moment, and it's completely okay. And yes, I want to, I want to bring... Oh boy, why don't I just no, it's fine. why don't I just put you no. on a headlock? You can die any second. I'll let go whenever I want. No, because I want it to be fast and like up in the air. Like, really fast. I can do that. I'll throw you in the head. Really can't throw me that. I'm pretty fast. I still haven't had any. I'll throw you. I'm pretty fast. I'll shoot a hip toss. We're getting on. I'm gonna try to get him on one of the rides. I hate going on rides because I don't know who made them, and most likely they're probably made in China, which means they're gonna fall apart. If I were to get on any rides, it better be a permanent ride. So especially since these stupid rides are portable and they break down like every day. They don't. I've no... been on these rides so many times. And look how many brain cells you so have. So that's lost. one thing. Yeah, exactly. So that's one of the things I'm looking forward to getting him on one of them, um, getting on them myself. And yeah. I don't trust these stupid rides built by Mexicans, okay? <laughs> Mexicans wouldn't build them. How much are you on a bet? I saw a freaking Ricardo over there they using a wrench. Them. No, they work. No, they work them. They don't work. No, the Chinese built them, but the Mexicans assembled them. It's the worst team in the world. AKA, I'm scared. I'm not scared of roller coasters. I just love fun. I don't know if I want to drop I'm looking forward to eating all this food. So far, I ate corn on a cob, corn, hot dog on a stick, a ice cream, or chocolate dipped, nut covered ice cream to be exact, turkey leg, probably some more food. But right now, my chest hurts because I have all this food right. stuck right here. Because I was purposely like, oh no, I ain't gonna drink anything because I want to get iced tea. But I just stuffed myself with all this food and just got stuck. Look, I gave him the Joe. The Joe Pompadour. Well, today, I just, my only goal for today is to have Isaac create more memories. No, I want the free song. Because the last time we came to the OC Fair, since that was his first time meeting Casey, and Casey's such a big part of his life now. So he already has like, good memories at this fair, so all I want to do is just build on that. Are your face in here? No, don't. Why? This is so soft. Camera. You should touch your <laughs> food. It's dark where you put your food. That guy has really big balls. He goes down to his knees. It's past his knees. That's why it's huge. Alright kids, we're about to get on this ride right now. Woo! Super excited. Check it out. Bart's over there. I don't know what's gonna happen. We're moving.
up. Oh my god, don't look down. I was just cracking up. Look at that. It was so funny. Oh fuck. We're literally fucking stuck at this pond right now. You're safe. You're safe down here. I'm trying to live. There's Mark. Down there. Is Tommy somewhere over here? It's so worth that. So, like I said, if it's not an emergency or work related, and mine was work related, continue with your bullshit story. She only said that just because she knew I was going to mention this. So, yesterday. Yeah, because you didn't know what was going on. <laughs> it's still funny, though. It's funny. on my back. So, no, this little part. And, and Gio ordered the same meal, right? And so they had a steak with the egg on it. So Bart got really excited. He goes, oh, you got eggs on yours too? He looks over. <laughs> she doesn't even acknowledge him. He goes, okay. <laughs> and he starts going back to his steak all the